I'm not real sure what I've got going on as far as what I've recorded. So I'm kind of starting over and throwing in some stuff that has happened since the last time I posted, which I know was a long time ago. Um, I haven't done anything in the bathroom area. It's basically storage right now for tools and things I'm working on. But yeah, I haven't done a whole lot in here. Still haven't gotten these pictures hanging, hanging, hung. <laughs> but I'll get to that. But I'll show you some pictures right here of my daughter and my son-in-law when they were here visiting and what they did. And here's what it looks like. So I've got my little, oh, and this light right here, my granddaughter, Nola. Um, she gets this if and when I get rid of it or I die, whichever happens first. She was mesmerized by that light. She would just sit and stare at it. This area is kind of all done. Giving that blanket back to the people that gave it to me. It's really pretty and it matches in here, but it's so heavy. Um, I don't think I could sleep under it. It's very, it's almost like a weighted blanket. It is so heavy, but it's pretty. I love it, but I think I'm gonna give it back to the people that gave it to me. Got my little pictures up. There's one. And there's one, just little floral things that kind of match with the burgundies and grays. And then I found this light, not light, but candle holder out in the shed. So I cleaned it up and I want to get a little candle. That's an old, old Chanel, um, Chanel, Chanel um, bedspread. But I really like it. it. It's lightweight, but I can always put another um, blanket on top or even my sleeping bag. Um, got the curtains up. Shade behind it. Still got paint. I can't decide what to do. What to, I don't know what to paint, but I know I'm tired of the white. But in the meantime, I have a beautiful floor. I'm so happy. Yes! I love it. I am so happy. I had thought about putting that stuff in here for a while. I knew my back wouldn't <clears throat> survive. And then when Tim and Lindsay showed up Super Bowl Sunday out of the blue, um, they asked if there was anything they could do to help. And I said, well, yes, as a matter of fact. So I showed them what I was thinking and what I wanted done. And uh, they made it happen. They made it happen. And I love it. I love it, love it, love it. I'm so excited. I can't wait to start traveling again. Um, hopefully, if things go good, um, March, middle of March, I may go back to the Seattle area. I'm sitting here looking at the bathroom thinking that instead of the bathroom being white, I could do some color back there. But I don't know what. I don't know. We'll get there. What a difference that makes. It looks so different. What do you guys think? And then on these windows next above the bed, I put the Reflectix up. One, to stop the cold from coming in. And two, as sort of, sort of a uh, room darkener. Because I'll tell you what, it gets bright. And then I also put one thing of Reflectix up there on the vent fan hole, whatever it is, because it is really bright. And then I got to get curtains up on the door. Countertop is pretty much cleaned off. I want to get a metal sink like they have in the Trail Manor and put in here. Um, it's one big sink. It's not the split. I don't really like the split. Seems like a waste of space. And I'd like to get the faucet 
that comes up a little higher. This is pretty hard to get to. So yeah, we're getting there. And then the big reveal is the floor. Look at this floor. Thank you so much, Tim and Lindsay, my daughter and her husband. They put the floor in and they did a beautiful job. But yeah, the floor turned out gorgeous. This is the same flooring that I have in my house. It's um, the peel and stick plank. I'll show you the, just happened to have a box. You peel the, the paper, this is one of the paper. You peel the paper off the back. Let's see. And I just turned it upside down. Anyway, it's got 30 planks, 30 square feet. And I think I used a box and a half in here. It's the, uh, got it from Lowe's. Lug luxury vinyl planks, style selections. I don't know if I have a, oh, a SKU number or whatever it's called. Where is it? There it is. Now, I got this um, several years back. I'm talking, whew, had to have been, let's see, three years, four years. Maybe five years ago, I got this flooring on sale at Lowe's around Christmas time. They were having a sale, and I just bought everything they had. I actually gave it away once, and they gave it back because they got rid of their RV. Lindsay, my daughter, did the bathroom, and she lifted the toilet off, put the, t the flooring down, and then she put the toilet back. Such a handy and smart girl. Oh, and by the way, today, February 16th, is her birthday. Happy birthday, Lindsay. Hope you had a good day. So, yeah, here's the flooring. And you just peel this paper stuff off on the back. And this is, this black stuff is, yeah, it's really sticky. But it went down really easy. Uh, Tim went to town, town being Chowchilla. Oh, I thought I was going to sneeze. And he picked up uh, liquid nails for me. Liquid nails. Just in case any of them lifted. <clears throat> and the only thing I did was along this fake step right there. You can't even tell there's a step there. But there is. I pulled all those off of that little area here, off this, and I put glue down because they weren't, they weren't really sticking good. They seem to be doing all right now. It seems to me there was another one. I think maybe it was, I think it was this one here. Wasn't quite sticking down, and I had, I'm not sure where it went. Well, it's like double stick tape, but it is for carpeting. I don't see it. I don't know where I put it. It's what I get for cleaning up fast so I can do a video. It's a double stick tape and they use it on carpet to hold edges of carpet down. But I used it in a couple of places on the floor. But other than that, it's uh, pretty nice. I, I really so, like yeah, it. This is the new look on the floor. And they just put it right down on top of the existing flooring and the main reason for me wanting to leave the old flooring down was it makes makes for a good i want to say sealant that may not be the word barrier in case there's a leak in here sink overflows, toilet overflows, something, it's not going to go through this flooring and straight onto the subfloor, the wood, and absorb and get rotted. It'll go right to the, the flooring that's underneath, which is a solid sheet of the vinyl. It is pretty. It's starting to look very cozy. So cozy. That's what Lindsay's boys say. It's cozy.